Many families here in Southern Colorado are struggling to put food on the table. A growing number of people are seeking food assistance after some of the additional pandemic benefits ended. Natasha Lynn reports from a food pantry in Colorado Springs, just one of many trying to do what they can to add more assistance right now. Food insecurity is on the rise in Southern Colorado. And because of this demand, food banks and pantries like this one are seeing more and more families in need of help. A family of four who relies on food assistance benefits is now receiving up to $360 less a month. Federal lawmakers voted to stop extra pandemic payments of $90 for each food recipient starting in March. It was a hard time for that, that federal assistance to go away because food prices are still so historically high. Uh, about 10% more expensive uh, this month than it was a, a year ago at the grocery store just for your, your basic groceries. So for so many families to lose that federal assistance, uh, a lot more families and people are relying on food banks. Care and Share and its nearly 300 partner agencies in Southern Colorado are feeling the strain of the increasing demand. Food banks like Care and Share and food banks all across the country, we've seen an increase at all of our partner agencies across Southern Colorado in need. Uh, initially, we thought about 10%, and we're seeing somewhere between 15 and 20% increase in need. Katie Boykin, a single mother, relies on food stamps to put food on the table. To be able to provide for my daughter has just been really difficult, and my um, income and the amount of time that I have available to be able to work just isn't sufficient enough. She's still waiting for her benefits to be renewed after submitting the paperwork in February. So I didn't receive my food stamps this month, and at this point, there's no future food stamp coming. The single mother says she's going to be forced to rely on food pantries and drives to get by. It does have to cause people to pick up a second job and things like that, and like that's something that I have definitely had to think about, which would be which would suck a lot because I'm a single parent and that would give me no time with my daughter. If you are in need of assistance, we have a link on our website right now, krdo.com, to find a local food pantry in your area. Reporting in Colorado Springs, I'm Natasha Lynn for KRDO News Channel 13.